say about my kids, Boosie, all the people who got something to say, Jay Boogie, who, I thank you because you're allowing the conversation to keep going forward because you know what? You might not have the answer today. I don't have all the answers, but we're growing from all these conversations. So I thank everybody for even hating and starting those conversations because those conversations are starting other conversations that we need to have and that's happening out there. So I don't hate okay. it. What I'm dealing with people is I'm dealing with life and death. It's people in the transgender community that are getting killed. It's kids that are murdering themselves. They're hanging themselves. They're killing themselves because you know what? Some symbol is acceptance. Some symbol is, is, is unconditional love. It's not being given to these kids. Mm -hmm. And I'll be damned if my child going to be that person because of some symbol is me supporting who you are. The information that comes out about, you know, black transgender women, you know, it, it, it's so sad, man. And, um, Mm -hmm. those, those numbers are staggering. It's, it's, it's unbelievable. It, it makes you it, sick. You got to look at yourself in the mirror. You got to go to that mirror and look in the mirror. And, and when you have kids and say, all right, if my kid is going to be boom, 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 how are you going to deal with it, sir? And awesome. when it came to Zaya, let me tap in. Okay, Zaya, let me look in the mirror because I'm going to tell y'all something. And people don't, don't want to hear this shit and don't believe this shit. At three years old, me and my wife looked at each other and we said, what if? Mm. What if? At the time, the name was Zion. If Zion comes home one day and said, Dad, I'm gay, or Dad, I'm this, I'm that, what are you going to do, sir? That's real. And so what I did at three, at when Zion was three, is I prepared myself, and I looked in the mirror, and I said, yeah, what are you going to do? So when we sat down, and, it was a, and I was in the room across the way, I prepared myself for five years for that moment, not knowing what I was going to do or say. When, when Zion sat down with me and was across the way, just like me and you are right now, Ryan, I look, I'm looking at my child. I don't, I don't care about anything else. I'm looking at my child, and I'm looking at my responsibilities. I'm looking at a child that's crying, that's afraid to tell their father wow. that they're different than what you probably thought I was, Dad. I don't want to play basketball. I'm, I don't, sorry, I don't even want to be, I'm not a boy. I feel that I am X, Y, and Z, right? I'm looking at my child, scared to tell me, and I feel like I am pretty open at this time. I realized that I needed to do better and I needed to do more and I needed to educate myself. When did Zaya have that conversation with Eight you? Eight years old, five years later. Okay, so here's my question, right? Because that was, that was, I looked at Zaya and I know the only thing that we want to do is to see our children smile, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. But what I also realized, I was like, so he's been loving, he's been supportive, he's become a champion beyond his child. And I said, and this looked easy. I can't believe that it was easy. It's not our job and our responsibility to tell you who you are. You are going to be who you're going to be. It's my job to try to put you in the best positions to help you reach that, that goal of who you want to be. But it's my, not my job to tell you. Right. You know what I mean? And right now, we experiencing that with Zaya, my 13-year-old, who last year we came out and we spoke to the world that, hey, my 13-year-old came home and said, Dad, this is who I am. I am a transgender child. And we didn't come out until she was 12 to the world. Mm -hmm. But the reason we came out to the world was because I got tired of trying to hide my child, not, not posting Zai, because we posted one thing on her birthday and there was so many bad comments that we wanted to hide her from it. Right. But it came to a point where I said, am I hiding her from it or am I hiding myself from it? How do you move it forward? Yeah, like, and so like doing like- It's not even moving forward.